Palestinian children in the West Bank, marching for Palestinian children in Gaza. This show of solidarity saw residents of Ramallah not only on strike, but also on the streets. The Palestinian people deserve support. We're a peace-loving people, but we are rising up in the face of a far-right government in Israel and a far-right administration in the United States. Calls for a ceasefire came from a new generation of Palestinians, angry at Israeli bombardment. We are marching to stop the war, to stop the killing of children in Gaza, and please God, so that Gaza wins. As well as an end to the war, these demonstrators displayed their support for a Palestinian state, and some of them for Hamas. Young Palestinians here in Ramallah are not content just to strike. They also wanted to come out onto the streets to show their anger against Israel and against the West. And across the checkpoint in Jerusalem, a complete shutdown in the Muslim quarter of the old city. The strike will be felt in people's pockets after a significant loss of trade and tourist income since the 7th of October attack. According to the Arab Chamber of Commerce in Jerusalem, nine in ten businesses have seen their profits reduced to close to zero. We are in Jerusalem, the Palestinian people, not only against what Israel is doing in Gaza. We are we also uh, against who's the, uh, the, the, the internationals who support Israel to do this with us, especially United States and Britain and Italy and Germany. Israel and its international allies say the conflict must continue until Hamas releases all of its hostages and no longer poses a threat. But Palestinian activists are desperate for more international support to stop the war before more Gazan civilians pay the price. Muhanna Tutunji, BBC News Arabic, Ramallah.